Okay, so this is day two of week one of the How to Train series. We are, today's a recovery day, um, a loosening up and active recovery, very gentle, steady state cardio. So for my steady state cardio, we're about to go for a dog walk down to the beach. Um, it's gorgeous weather here today, so I think uh, probably get in the water for a swim as well. Um, it shouldn't feel like exercise today, it should just feel like going outside, get some fresh air, enjoy yourself, go for a walk. Uh, but before I do that, uh, I've got three kids that are all coming down with us and one of them's only just woken up, so he's spooning Weetabix into his mouth at the moment. So I'm just going to do a little bit of mobility. And the mobility I'm going to do is something called rocking. And it's just a nice way to reset your hips, um, reset your spine. And it's a very natural movement. If anybody's had babies or knows people with very, very young babies, just as they're starting to learn how to crawl, the first thing we'll do when we get into this quadruped position on hands and knees, and they'll just rock backwards and forwards. And it's how they build the strength, literally, it's how they build the strength to be able to crawl. As you think about it, it's a plank. You know, you're having to lift a knee and a hand off the floor. It actually requires a lot of shoulder strength a lot of hip strength, a lot of core strength. So it's a nice little reset. I'm gonna do mine today, sandwiched between some socks and some laundry, and probably a Labrador that'll come lick my face. So you're gonna start on all fours, hands directly under the shoulders, knees are hip distance apart, and I'm gonna change my foot position from sometimes being on top of my foot, like that, and sometimes being on my toes. And all I'm going to do is I'm going to rock backwards and forwards. And that's all I'm going to do. And as I'm rocking, I'm going to slowly increase my range of motion. And I'll change my hand position. And I'll change my foot position. And I'll widen my knees or bring them together. And I'm going to do this for just 10 minutes. Just 10 minutes of rocking. None of it's hard. I'm not stretching. It's all very gentle. As I get warmed up, I might come down into a cobra stretch or it's either up dog, down dog, or sideways dog. I can never quite remember. And then sort of push back as well. Just open up the hips and the hip flexors. Get the spine going up. So today, go for a walk, do a little bit of ground-based mobility, and just enjoy the day. Thank you very much. So as part of my active recovery day of gentle exercise, I'm going to do some planting in the garden later on. I've got some cucumber. I've got a pear tree. I've got a lemon tree. We've got one, two, three, four lots of tomatoes. We have an apple tree to go with the other apple tree I've got in the garden already. We've got lemon balm, which is a type of mint, uh, but it's got an amazing lemon zesty smell to it. We've got some uh, bell peppers here, which have got nice red bell peppers. And I've got some more honeysuckle to go in front of my fence where these are blooming nicely and over the top of the fence I've done some trellis and we've got some jasmine growing there and some honeysuckle here but it's not doing particularly well it was the only one left at the garden centre and it wasn't uh, a particularly good representation of a plant so it might do okay we'll see uh, and then we've got some peppermint chives growing in pots some thyme we've got some dill some mint that's just starting to come through and some oregano so all looking very good so, my dog walk there's proof there's a dog there's my family okay and we're heading down to the sea. It's a beautiful day. It's still quite early, about 11 o'clock. 
the tide is high and it's been warm for a couple of days so we're gonna go for a swim well I say we Zoe won't because the sea is cold and wobbly and full of dangerous sea creatures that can kill you at any second yeah except it's not but here we go beautiful day some gentle aerobic exercise Get outside, enjoy yourself, do a bit of mobility and stretching, and enjoy the fact that today you're not lifting weights, but yesterday you did, and tomorrow you will again. See you in a bit. With Jim the dog, about to go for a swim. This is Jackson's Bay, which is my personal private beach. Oh, there's Max, going in the water. There he is. Jim's about to follow. Ah, so, welcome to Jackson's Bay, my personal private beach, which begrudgingly allow other people to use. And it is just beautiful here today. Ah, looking forward to go swimming. <laughs> 